Hey guys, Elijah Zane, I'm a Sonic Collector here, and today I'm going to be doing the unboxing and setup of the Sam's Club 2023 Musical Skeleton Duo. Here we go. <laughs> This guy, um, due to the or these guys, because there's actually two of them, because um, I bought all of the other new uh, animatronic singers and um, you know, like the punk rockers and Costco and the two from and the two and the two from Rose. And I'm planning on making like a uh, stage with all of them on it. Um, and this one. It's a really good price, and my opinion is pretty, it's pretty cool. Um, and it's for indoor and outdoor, you can do it a booth, so that's nice. It's part of a base, standard PAC base. Oh wow, there's actually lots of pieces here. And um, we have one of their hats, we have another hat, two different colors. This it's heavy because oh, it comes with try a try me button. That's cool. Um, some other metal pieces, some stakes, um, all that good stuff. The hats kind of feel like coat rack monsters hats, believe it or not. Um, two light poles. Two more light poles. Um, let's pick out the heads. Okay, this is actually really cool. I think this guy's servo. Um, it's not SVI, but it's pretty cool. The mouth is, you know, open and closing. You know, the eyes look pretty weird, but they also look pretty cool. Now, um, has a weatherproof connector. The servo's actually, I think this is servo. I can't tell you 100%, but uh, it's connected to the spine piece here. Exactly the same. Same exact everything. Plastic connector. You've got two feet for one of the skeletons. You can see right there. Um, which are actually two of the same feet. But that's actually okay. So that would be for both of the skeletons. That makes sense. Because both of these are the same. So. <laughs> two feet. <laughs> Yeah, not like Immortal Werewolf from Home Depot last year. That was a mess. There's like so many people getting two of the same feet or two of the same hands. That was not fun. Um, got an arm here. Which actually, what? This is not what? That's crazy. This is wait. This is like rubber. What the heck? Okay, that's weird. Now, I don't know how that's gonna hold up outside. That's my thing about that. Um, but there's the plastic connector. That's crazy. I was not expecting that. Um, the other one. Once again, rubber. Have another arm. Another arm. The old rubber. Um, Body, which I, I pretty much oh there's some other things in here as well. Here is the trumpet. Well, yeah, that, here's the trumpet. It's very small, but pretty cool. Um, you gotta be really careful with that. Some pretty little plastic. Oh, well, there's some legs, um, knee knee bones, and all this um, cape and everything like that is here. Middle connections. There's the waist turning neck, volume control, signal cable, which is connecting the two, and the adapter jack, all weatherproof, which is so nice, because um, I love weatherproof cars. These connect the two bases together, two sides of the bases together. I can tell that because I've owned lots of PAC props, and that's how it all usually is. But the saxophone, which is pretty cool. Um, whoa, that's weird, but that's how it's supposed to be, I guess. Um, more leg bones. More 
so this is like the this is like the 12 foot skelly um, to do that. There's some more leg bones. One there. One there. That's it for this guy. This one has the sensor on it. Um, whoa, this one has more going on. Okay, so it has the on and off switch, the try me button, DC jack, signal cable, and volume. So, my thing is, why would there be two volumes? I think there would only be one speaker in them, but that's good. Um, double speakers, double loudness, because they have two different instruments, so I guess that makes sense. Um, two more leg bones, uh, cardboard, um, base pieces, more base pieces, and I believe that is it. So, let's get to the setup. Now these guys run you about 160 bucks plus tax at your local Sam's Club, and I think that's an amazing price for these guys. Um, the, I mean, two props at Spirit would be over $400, so you know, two nozzles would be $700. <laughs> but uh, um, thank God he's not coming back because that was way overpriced. But um, yeah, they're a, they are pretty cool. Um, like I said, I'm gonna pair them with my Costco Punk Rocker and the Lowe's Bluetooth Reapers. Um, I'm going to make a huge band, and I'm hoping to get a few more of the little band items um, for a little bit more of a kid-friendly section before uh, my haunt, uh, so that'll be pretty cool. Uh, but you really can't beat it for 160. They're pretty sturdy. They've got the standard PAC base, um, Vintage Creations base, metal uh, all the way up to the legs, and then after that, it's plastic, but there may be some metal armature or, um, in here. I believe there is. There's the sensor on the guy with the uh, saxophone. Um, there's a red one and a silver one. As you can see, they all have different hats as well, according to their capes. Um, the eyes actually look pretty cool, to be honest with you. Um, they're, they look better than I was expecting. Uh, so yeah, that's a plus. Uh, pretty, it was just annoying to put together because uh, some pieces wouldn't fit together right and um the the pieces look similar but they were very different actually uh so i mean for the first half i didn't really use the instructions um but then i decided to because uh there was you had to figure out which um leg went on which character and it shouldn't make a difference because they're exactly the same structure until you get up to the body um but you know it's whatever but yeah, they are pretty cool. Um, I really have nothing, nothing else to say about them. Um, you should go and pick them up if you have a kind of like a band theme, uh, not a band theme, but just um, if you want a more kid-friendly prop, um, which I usually don't like that. But you know, there's a lot of kids in my area that go trick or treating, so we wanted to make a kid-friendly kind of section. Um, but yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.